Hello everyone, this is Hunter Collector with another extra figure review, and here we have the Marvel Legends series Spider-Man No Way Home Wave uh, Black and Gold suit. So let's go over the packaging first. So first we get to the Marvel Legends logo here on top. Spider-Man No Way Home down here at the bottom. A little description of the suit. And then we got the Spider-Man, MCU Spider-Man logo here furnished on top. Here is the center of the black and gold suit with the Spider-Man emblem there. Here is the back with the information of the black and gold suit. And then we, uh, for this wave, we'd be building Armadillo. We already went through the integrated suit. Now we're doing the black and gold suit. Uh, we still need to go through Doctor Strange, uh, J. Jonah Jameson. We already we already did uh, Game Reverse Miles Morales. And we still got to do Moreland and Shriek. And then here is the other sides of the side art. And then here is the bomb with the DCPI. But besides that, let's crack them open. And here is the black and gold suit out of the package here. So let's go over the accessories first. So first we get Armadillo's left leg, which we'll go over once we build them. And then we get two whipping hands. Uh, so in the promo art, if you saw, uh, he his whole hands are actually black and gold. Uh, this is like a little concept. So the reason why it's red for our hands here still is because of concept art. So it's not really Hasbro's fault. I'm pretty sure they'll re-release this later on down the road. But yeah, you get that shiny plasticky looking red paint there for the fingers still. Uh, but you do get the matte black for the rest of the hand here. So you get two of these swooping hands here. And that's all we got for accessories. So here is the black and gold Spider-Man suit up close. So here is the face uh, sculpt here. So... I think this is basically the same mold as the Far From Home suit. Uh, it's just repainted with some different types of paint and uh, different colors. So, yeah, it's just a, basically a repaint. Um, so, yeah, you get that same head sculpt here. Uh, you can kind of see there's some shininess going on there. That's because there's a... It's basically... A, it's like an inside-out suit, kind of. Uh when I think about it, and it has the gold webbing, uh, you get some shiny black spots there for like the tech pieces, I guess. And then overall, it's kind of just a matte black look, but you get some like shiny wiring going on there. Um, you still get the leather straps here for like the shoulders, but you can't really tell because it's covered in matte black. Uh, you get some gold splotching there. And then, yeah, this is the part where I was talking about where you still get the red uh from the far from home suit uh you get like these web holding hands but you didn't get a piece of web like the far from home suits did uh you get some red splotching there still uh there's a few spots where it has some black shininess uh on the forearms but not a lot um but then on the biceps you get a little bit more and then the legs you get some so that's a really cool detail i like a lot about this figure is that it has like the shiny black there to show the tech stuff. And then for the gold webbing here for like where the leather straps would be, uh, you get some gold tech pieces there too. You get some extra gold techs, I mean, uh, like shiny black on the feet here. Um, I th yeah, this is the same exact sculpt off of that one actually the newer version of the far from home suit because you can see that they sculpted in the soles actually they just didn't paint it uh so you can't really tell and then here's the back here with the spider that has the gold lining around it but it's just basically completely black uh you get the belt here but it's kind of hard to see because you just get the gold pieces there so yeah, I think this is a really cool figure though still. Uh, so let's go over the articulation for him. So it's basically the same thing as the Far From Home suit uh, that we last did, I think. So he has a disc ball joint, so you can hinge down that far, look up that far, left and right. Uh, it's a little rocking there. Um, shoulders can move out that far. 360 rotation there. He has butterfly joints there. He has bicep swivels. You still get peg joints there, so that's also how you know that this is the same exact sculpt as the Far From Home suit. Uh, double uh, jointed elbows. Wrists can hinge down that far, up that far. 360 rotation there. He has an ab crunch, so you can go down that far. He can go back that far. He has a waist swivel, 360 rotation there. Legs can kick out that far. 
I kick forward that far, backwards a little bit, thigh cut, double jointed knees, and then ankles can hinge down that far, up that far, nice ankle pivot. So yeah, that's the black and gold Spider-Man suit from No Way Home. I really like this figure. I just wish they did something different for their forehands and the actual hands for it to make it look more accurate to the movie. But I do know this is concept art based, so it's not really a big issue for me. Um, I'm sure they'll re-release re it, but I guess if you want to fix that, you can paint it gold if you want. The red part's gold, so up to you about that. Uh, I'm going to leave it as is just because um, I don't like really messing with my figures um unless someone does it for me so <laughs> or if i have a second one because i usually want to keep the original and maybe if i get a second one i'll customize it but uh yeah this is a really cool figure i do recommend you get them because i really like the gold and black look for it um but yeah the articulation's good um i don't really have anything against it at all um the paint job is really cool i like the shiny black parts for the uh like tech look and i like the gold paint to make it more reflective it doesn't really look messy for me so i think it looks pretty good um but yeah i recommend you get them if you find them uh, make sure you guys check out my link tree in the description it has my tiktok twitch instagram and all that good stuff on there so make sure make sure you guys go check that out but besides that thanks for watching